<laughs> Where's our man bun tonight? <laughs> I hope he's not listening. Well, good evening. This is quite surprising. It's a small gallery here tonight. <laughs> and you should probably end fairly early. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to this meeting of the Old Kings Highway Committee of County Yarmouth, which is being held in accordance with Chapter 470 of the Acts of 1973 as amended. It's at 7.15 p.m. Monday, April 25th, 2022, at the Yarmouth Town Hall Hearing Room, located at 1146 Route 28, South Yarmouth. In addition, we are operating um, in accordance with Chapter 20 of the Acts of 2021, which is considering uh, COVID-19 measures and we work in a hybrid mode, so someone may come through this is Zoom. There are two applications for certificates of appropriateness and two table certificates of appropriateness, which will be heard this evening in the order that was listed on the agenda. Please be reminded that a committee's main purpose is to review items for appropriateness and setting, and it's the responsibility of the applicant to comply with regulations of other town boards and departments, including the building, conservation, engineering, health, zoning, and the sign inspector. You should also know that there is a 10 calendar day appeal period starting once a decision is filed with the town clerk. Any person aggrieved by our decision tonight can appeal to the regional commission of the Old Kings Highway. And our office administrator will be happy to answer any questions you have with respect to that process. I think I should put this down. I speak softly, so I, maybe that'll help. So the first item tonight is concerned with painting a house and trim and replacing roofing at 46 Summer Street, Jennifer Troutman, Bartleman. Bartleman is the owner. So if you want to, you could come up to that table and use the microphone if you want to explain anything. This would be a big change. I, I always have noticed this house when I yeah. drive by. And it's, uh, I think I'm in. Sturbridge. Sturbridge is <laughs> <laughs> I always call it Sturbridge Red, yeah. Yeah. So we're gonna give that a rest. Huh? Keeping the door red, huh? No, we did not intend to keep the door red. We intend. Yeah, oh, where are you? I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> it's a different red. That's it's all. It's a different, red. not the same red. Yeah. Right. Not the same. <laughs> it's a heritage red. I should have known. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it's a yeah. different red. I like that. Oh. The red looks more, this red, it looks more like the siding. Mm -hmm. And the red that's there now is but brighter. Right. Or bold. Yeah. So you're going to put. Um, Driftwood shingles on the roof, landmark type, architectural. And the clapboards and the shingles would be this gray. Fancy name, I would like to have fancy names. Rock, port, gray. And then the door would be this. And the trim. What is that? White. 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 Okay. Yeah. Which will go better with the gray. And the trim around the door is all white too. Yeah. How about your storm door? White? You know? We anticipated being a white one with a full view okay. glass so that you'd see the door. Okay, good. Yeah, that would work. 
I like I like it. Mm -hmm. Looks yeah. great. I like that color gray. I move to approve. Second. All those in favor? Andy? Aye. 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 You doing the roofing yourself? The re roofing? I'm sorry? You doing the re roofing yourself? No. It says no, contractor owner. I haven't hired so. anyone yet. If you have oh, any suggestions, okay. let me know. <laughs> I don't know if we can do that. <laughs> I think that speaks. <laughs> Okay, so now we have to do some paperwork. You have to wait one minute. No. Come on down. And were there any butters? <laughs> yeah. We have to do uh, the, no. the butter question. Oh, excuse us. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, no this comments. document just says you're going to do it the way you've planned. Mm -hmm. Any changes, please okay. let us know in advance. Okay. I like the red door. Yeah. yeah. I had just, yeah. So if you sign the top one, I'll sign the bottom one. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. It looks Good beautiful. Luck with it. Yeah, Gorgeous. Like, yeah, oh, sure. <laughs> Thank you. Good night. Okay. The next item is also to paint a house, the doors, shutters at 10 Belvedere Terrace. The homeowner is Betsy Johnson, and she is here. Good <laughs> evening. Mine are real and it makes a huge yeah, difference. It doesn't look anything like this. So oh, wow, that's yeah. exactly why I realized. Let me pull my. Oh, yeah. Uh, that's more of a light gray, that blue. Yeah. No, these are nice. Yeah. That didn't work. <laughs> So did you have photocopies and not the real chips? We so have the real it? chips. I, I have the photocopy. She has the real chips. That's what oh, I was asking. I think the, the photocopy chips make a difference. Nothing it like it. Yeah. I have an extra set here. Did you want to see That's them? Okay. Do you okay, guys have you. the real chips? Yes. Okay. Now okay. yeah, everybody's got them now. Well, I did. You do. Okay. And Sharon. I have three chips. You just have four. Yeah. What do you have? Oh, the whole chips are fun. <laughs> Oh, <clears throat> so this is a uh, wood clapboards all around. Yes, except for the natural shingles, one which are on natural. the back and half east, of one side. side. You're leaving those natural? Yes. Okay. Let's see now. The shutters. Stop. Dark. 
Well, the door has this. The door is French violet. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Yeah, the door is fr French, French violet. That's pretty. Mm -hmm. but I did make a mistake on the number. Shots. I don't know whether the number matters to you on the French violet. 1427. No. It's 1427. Yeah. Oh, okay. And not 1565. Yeah. No, 1565 is the house color, Mount St. Anne. Yeah. Okay. Yep. As long as these, these chips are correct. Yeah, I have the right chips. Okay. <laughs> it appears that there's a, a white uh, screen door. Or yes, I intend door. to keep that white. Okay. Mm -hmm. So it looks like the, from looking at the chips here, yes. the shutters are very close in color to the siding, just a little bit darker color. Yes. Yeah. Stand out. So are you going to keep the same uh, storm front door that you have, the yes. cross buck? Mm -hmm. It's going to hide that beautiful violet door. I wonder, well, I wonder about the fading of violet. Which? Which? The fading. Oh, okay. The violet. Like yeah. fading. Mm. So having the door over it. I've talked um, uh, to people at the paint store. Um, about this color, and they suggested um, a gloss on the door that would help with the fading. And it's black now, and it gets very warm between the storm door yeah, right. and the. Has it has it blistered? Yes, I had a black door that blistered. Yes, yeah. mm -hmm. and um, so I had a painting contract there today to give me an estimate, and we talked about the door, and he said, "No, your door's in good condition." And he thought that this color was better um, in terms of darkness. And he also said, I really recommend a semi-gloss on the door. And that evidently helps protect the fading too. Right. You yeah. probably know that more than I do, but that's what they told me at the paint store. Well, he also said the crossbuck door would protect it as well, so. Yes. Yeah, the UV radiation. Yeah. yeah. Really pretty. The alternative, Knoxville Gray. Yes. Should we consider that? Uh, well, I'll tell you what the situation is for that. The house faces south, and there are no big trees in the front, so the sun really hits it high. And of course, I was using just chips. <clears throat> and um, so I went out and tested it different times of day. And my, my preference is the Templeton Gray to keep a very soft look. Mm -hmm. But at times, when the sun was really bright, it didn't show up that much. So, uh -huh. and the painter told me the same thing today. He said, once you get the body of the house on, you know, it may, that's when you want to sort of finalize what your shutter color is. Mm -hmm. So that's why I gave you two, because I think it, my intention is to have one of the two. So and what's the Knoxville gray? Does anybody have a chip of that? Is that on the back? Yeah, it's not that, much different. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's just a little darker. It's a little darker. It's on the same uh, strip. Slightly darker. So did, I'm sorry, did you say that when the, sun's hitting the house that there's not as much contrast between the shutters and the body yeah. with, with the, the with the um, temple temple gray. gray yes yeah i like having more contrast yeah. personally but mm -hmm. <clears throat> i don't like it as much with the violet though for some reason really with the violet door but they're separate yeah. yes yeah. exactly they're far also, enough away what that, doesn't yeah. show up i think they're both acceptable well, so. thank yeah. you what what doesn't show up in that picture <clears throat> is and because the house has been all white is i have between the windows and the roof edge, there's nice dental molding. And on either side of the door, there are sort of fluted, uh, it's not columns because they're flat, but mm. fluted. And that I intend to keep all white. So it would sort of pop that the sounds, color. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. Can we approve both shutter colors so that you could have a choice? So sure. that you could have a choice once yeah, the so. body of the house is painted? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Where did you say the dentals are at the roof line? Yeah, roof line. Yes, all along yes, the front of the house oh. at the roof line. Oh, I can't see it in this picture very well. Uh, yeah, it really doesn't show up in the picture. And the garage doors stay white. Yes. What about the um, door in the back of the garage? The back of the garage, I was sort of like, let me talk to a painter and somebody else. And so he suggested today that I go with the house color on the back of the garage, the same as the front with the white trim. Mm -hmm. When you say the back of the garage, do you mean where the shower is? Yes. Yeah. Okay. It's just that one section of yeah. the back. Gotcha. So that the garage would be sort of one yeah. color with Wrap the white on. trim. Mm -hmm. yep. So the drawer would be the same as the body. 
the back door of the garage. Same it wouldn't be the wouldn't be the violet. It would be the house color. Is that what you're saying? The door of the garage door, next the, to the shower. Next to the shower, that oh. door on the back of the garage. Yeah, to tell you the truth, I hadn't really decided on that because I wanted to talk to the painter. It's either going to be white or the violet. Yeah, yeah. it's yeah. not visible from this. Yeah, it's right. not visible from the, neighbor, from the neighbors. Looks good to me. Good. Okay, do we have a motion to? I move to approve. Thank you. Second. Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Thank you. Aye. No. Noah Butters, right? <laughs> <laughs> we have to so, try to remember. Unless they're invisible. All oh, my butters, so I have been showing them the colors. The guy. <laughs> they didn't feel they needed to come. That's <laughs> fine. So if you would come and sign this document sure. for me, please. The barn is back. See the man. Okay. <laughs> The man. So if you Thank can make you. any changes, drastic changes at least. Okay. <laughs> Let us know. I know I need new garage doors, so they will be white, and I think I have to come back to you for that, right? Another yeah. day. At, an, yeah. at another time. There you go. I like your pin. Okay. okay. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Is, that, is that one signature? Yep. Okay. That's it. So That's it. Free to go. Okay. Thank you very much. All That's right. Great. Have a good night. Thanks. Good night. More information now. <clears throat> no, they on the. This the one's on the. Yeah. All right, we don't seem to have anybody left. Is this? Is this a Zoom thing? Maybe they were. They're the ones yeah, from New Hampshire. Must be a Zoom. Oh. Well, is anybody waiting? Or? Yeah, the the next um the barn is on Zoom. She's um, and maybe he is too. But um, they're on the Zoom call. <clears throat> she is. Parents. Do we need to sign the doc? Oh. It's I don't coming. Know. Are you, are you, there we go. On its way. Hi. Hi. <laughs> we hear you. There they are. <laughs> Take care of our paperwork. <laughs> Ready. Oh, that's a pretty color. Is that the color of what? Oh, oh green. The uh, doors. Door. Yeah. Nice. Mm -hmm. Okay. First, we have to take this off being tabled. Ah, so yes. I move to untable the proposal for uh, 142 Route 6A, Vincent and Taryn Zucara. Zucala. I'll second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Okay. Now we can consider this project. In addition to the proposal, we have two very supportive letters from Butters to the property. Karen and Mark Lowen. So, uh, Susan B. and Philip Witt are at 146, or 6A, and uh, they wholeheartedly approve of the plans for the freestanding barn in a very spacious backyard. Share your enthusiasm for the project, etc. So, and then Karen and Mark Rowan, we've reviewed the plans for the barn as the callers are proposing to build on their property. Looks like it will be a beautiful building in keeping with the character of 6A. So they heartily support it as well.
Well, chrome green doesn't sound very appealing. It looks pretty good. Does anybody have the real chip? I do. I, I think it's nice. Well, no, I don't. But I guess. I don't have the real chip. Richard no. does. And it's it's nice. It's it's what you would expect. A nice, rich yeah, forest green. It's, it's the current color of our shutters on the home. Oh, nice. Very good. So the green is going on what? It's it's the door. Oh. Doors. And um, one, two barn doors, one side door. And it matches their um, shutters on their home, which will be nice. And are the, um, the gooseneck lamps are going to be the same green, similar green? Uh, the, the goose will hopefully will find nice brass. I, I'm trying to find older fixtures. Those onion lamps or the onion lamp you have a photograph of is probably 75 years old. It's handmade. It's very, very nice if you look at details. Beautiful. Yeah. Uh, so I'm trying to find, uh, it, I promise you it won't be a Home Depot gooseneck. I, I can <laughs> <laughs> tell you that. No. <laughs> This is one that is kind of match or has some nice kind of Yeah. I think they're sure able to see that from the street. Yeah. Nice. I think it's mm -hmm. very nice. There, there, there is a place in Sandwich that makes the onion lamps like this. Mm. Is that the um, right in Sandwich Center there? The, mm -hmm. uh, no, it's by the medical center. Oh. Sandwich lantern. Did you, were you able to hear that? Yeah, well, we, we, we heard it, yes. So we already have the lamps, is what I'm saying. That That's an actual photograph of, of a lamp that I purchased for the barn. I'm hoping to find uh, uh, a similar gooseneck lamp of, you know, a patina brass, et cetera, et cetera. So it has the look. What's this um, in front of the barn? This, uh... Is it a garden or something? What is it? Well, it shows. It says, yeah, in front, yeah. Of the, in front of the barn, there's a garden, but that would go away. Oh, okay. Well, I think it's very nice, personally. Thank you Thank for you. back with the plans. <laughs> I move to approve. I second. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Super. All All set. Set. <laughs> Except for the ones who call wrote in. How long have you been living here in this, well, well did you buy it? Eight years, nine years. Oh, wow. We're only part-timers though right now. Are you, are you down here permanent now? No. Not, not yet, okay. Not yet. Not yet. That, so, barn, that barn's a critical piece. Uh, where, where are you now? Because you have the most beautiful clock and, and Oh, thank you. We, we live in an old carriage house of uh, the governor of New Hampshire, believe it or not, Governor Floyd. And this was um, his mansion was next door to us. We're in Manchester, New Hampshire. So he was the, the uh, interim governor in 1902. And uh, his mansion burnt down and this was converted to a home uh, 1915. So it's a it's a really cool old mansard roof, slate roof, uh, cottage Victorian. Oh, wow. Nice. Which used to hold his animals and his carriages and et cetera, et cetera. So it's all mill brick. And then uh, we love antiques. I, I, I'm passionate about them. I've got several, uh, several grandfathers and grandmothers. And, um, what will you do in the barn? Storing antiques? <laughs> well, you know, I do a lot. I'm a woodworking hobbyist and I, uh, I make custom furniture. The table that we're sitting at is all cherry that I made about 35 years ago. So I just like to dabble and I'm passionate about it. So it's it's um, critical for our happiness. Great. That's what retirement's so Yeah.
Can't be blasted. No. Nope. I can't hear you guys. Can you hear us? We can't hear you at this point. Oh, okay. So they're saying we can't. Yep, they connect, disconnected us. One person. Do we have anybody else? Oh, yeah. I know we were muted. Someone. So, can you hear us now? Yes. yes. yes thank you. you heard that you were approved, right? You heard that? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Good. So we're all set. Thank you so much. Thank you. You're welcome. And Lisa, public thank you for all your help. Really appreciate it. No problem. Glad we got straightened right. out. Good night, everybody. Bye. Have a good night. <laughs> okay, we have to untable. Okay. I move to untable the project at 53 Valhalla Drive, South Yarmouth, Keith O'Brien and Kimberly Norton O'Brien. I'll second. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Good. So this here? is um, at 53 Valhalla Drive to paint clapboards, shingles, shutters, doors, and trim. The homeowners are Keith O'Brien and Kimberly Norton O'Brien. Richard Conway is the agent. So maybe Richard Conway would. Do we have anybody on Zoom? On board. No. I don't know if it's Gerald is on Zoom, but I'm not sure she's- I've admitted the one person waiting in Zoom, but they haven't uh, entered the room yet. Oh. I'm still waiting for them to like reply. Okay, uh, yeah. Uh, but it's not any name that's on the agenda. Yeah, it's- oh. um, It was yeah. probably another painter. Huh. Painter's helper. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like they just left. Yeah, they just dropped, so I don't- I don't think they're here again. Yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> do, do we table it again? Um, Give them a minute. Yes, we need to. <coughs> it's pretty straightforward. Mm -hmm. It is. Uh, they're quite acceptable colors. Well, and they're both was, they're both historic colors from the Benjamin Moore catalog. Yep. And it's a white trim, white garage doors. It'd be an improvement. <laughs> yeah. Do you have the actual chips? I don't. Peter, I don't even see it. it looks like white. It's I didn't white bother to color. look it up, but I wonder if, if we had done this house before, like maybe three years ago. Yeah, I don't know. Right. In that same neighborhood, it's a, Valhalla is a short street. No, okay. How many houses on it? Yeah. yeah, these, again, we can't look at our copies or Xeroxes or you make us think that they're images. doing it navy blue. <laughs> The blue is pretty. No, well, done. it's not going to be blue. <laughs> it's not going to be blue. blue. Uh, uh These are the colors. Oh, oh this looks. This blue. looks quite blue. It's a dark yeah, blue. Yeah, that's a Xerox. Deep, deep blue. So that's for the doors. Is yours blue as well? Yeah. Blue. Yeah. Those are I like Xerox. The she has the real chips. Yeah, we've we've oh. okayed hail blue before. Oh, yeah, it's pretty. Hail navy. So yeah, this is the doors, and that's the body, the wood, the no, that's uh, um siding. Siding. Yeah, the body of the house. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's quite different. Mm -hmm. So, which is the real color here? Do you know it's this one? Chip. Yeah, it's chip. much closer to it. Oh, that's very dark. That'll be pretty. Yeah, I had looked that up on the internet a few months ago, but there was another job. Do you have the real color? I wanted to just do the front door. Dark, yes. real blue. Mm -hmm. Right. And I went yeah. to the so website you for got it. got a feeling for it. I like it. Mm -hmm. I think it's nice, it's nice and rich. It's a lot nicer than what they have. <laughs> what do we do without everybody? So what it, does it say what they want to do the shutters in? 
Shutters. shutters. Repainted fabric shutter, shutter, shutters. shutters, doors, and trim. So oh, it what is this says shutters. the bind is pewter. We didn't get a notice from that they would. Sometimes they send a note Those that we can shutters act on their behalf. Oh, the shutters they want to do. They, they never Navy responded, also. but in the, in it the, looks like the shutters. Know, the it's pretty Navy. straightforward. You could, I, you could so go ahead match and... the door. Yeah, that would look nice. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> we'd be getting into good weather now for painting. That's probably why we get three or four in mm. each meeting now. So should we table this again? I don't know. What's the problem? Yeah. How many What's times can you table something? You can table it all a few times, but the thing is, do they have to be forty-five days it will get approved anyway? Have you had any uh, communication from them at all? No, I sent them a, an email after the last time when we tabled it, and I never heard anything back. And I sent them another note. Why last did we week. table it last time? Because nobody was here. We weren't here. Yeah. yeah. And so I sent another note last week oh. saying, you know, you're coming. You're coming up Monday. You know, FYI again, and I haven't heard back. So it's possible they don't realize you're supposed to be in attendance. I don't know. I mean, I when I send out the original email, it says, you know, you need to be there or an agent or somebody, you know, so they realize that it's. Yeah. You know. The plan hasn't changed. No. So. I mean, is there any kind of a <clears throat> protocol for approving things with no one here? Is that no, ever done? I don't think there is. I think we'd have to table it. That's why I was asking if they had sent a note in saying that we can act on their behalf. Oh. So we can, we've done that several times. And what's the 45 day thing? We, we have to. If you don't get acted on, you have to act okay. on their proposal yeah. within 45 days. Now, we've been putting in a modification to that because of COVID-19, where they sign a waiver so we can go beyond the 45 days. Yeah, because they would be right. They submitted the original application on March 6th. <clears throat> yeah. So they are coming. March 6th, we're already past 45 days. Mm -hmm. yeah. We're pretty close. But the waiver, right. I understand. To, right. Yeah, that. So it looks like they want to do the shutters and the door, the door in that hail Navy white trim, white garage doors, and pewter on the mm -hmm. body. I mean, I like it. There's no reason like not to approve it, except yeah, that they're what? not here. Why don't we uh, act on it and uh, take my lumps with uh, Jim Wilson if there. <laughs> I'll stand behind you. Okay. Way behind <laughs> I, I never saw him before. <laughs> well, then I, I move to approve. I'll second. Good. We have the lawyers on our side. <laughs> All in aye. favor? Aye. 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 Yay. Right. Well, fastest meeting ever. Nice. <coughs> Actually, we have, have minutes to approve right now. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So, how long are you going to be gone for? I'm coming back Tuesday. So, you're leaving Thursday, coming home Tuesday. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, maybe we could do something the week you come home. Then. Yeah. Because I want to try that place. I, I, yeah. I actually went there to get takeout once and, and they were closed, so I never saw that again. Yeah. Um, all right, so that is, um, so you're leaving on the 28th and coming back on the 3rd. Like, how about Wednesday the 4th? Wednesday would work. Okay. How, do we, how do we say that? Let's say that. Um, well, we do want to pick you up. I'll pick you up. Okay. Six. So, six is good. Okay. What's the name of that place? A tie something. Oh, it's, it's that ropes and something. Ropes and <laughs> It's when people uh, sign in different lines. He's Rogers. Rogers. Rogers and something. <laughs> okay. Yeah, but I'll pick you up. All right, love. Thanks. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> What's going on in the chat down there? Is someone trying to say something? Can you access that? Now, we had um, the minutes for the March 28th in our hands before the last meeting, and uh, we didn't act on them because I slipped my memory. So 
I assume everyone has read those. Any problems with any of the adjustments we should make? See any. Looked okay. So I move to approve the minutes from March 28th, 2022. I second. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Good. Okay. April 11th. Now, mm -hmm. April 11th has uh, been written up. I went through my copy. It looked good. Yeah. I gave um, Lisa a couple. Yeah. I, I right, so clarified. So just clarified. Right. Yeah. Wednesday, April 11th. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All good. I'll move to approve the minutes of Second. April 11th. Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Good. Okay. So you're okay. <clears throat> the, um, the commission has another appeal. Um, so not tomorrow, but next week on Tuesday. Uh, this is relative to sandwich. And um, if you get any newspapers from sandwich, You'll see what went on there. And um, what's the appeal? It's, it's, um, it's kind of a long story in the sense that there's, there's a house, there's a, there's a um, brewery, like one of these. Oh, yeah, microbrewery. Microbrewery, right on the waterfront. By the beach. Wow. Treehouse or something? Treehouse. Tree yeah, house. something like that. Oh, the right. Name of it. Yeah. And yeah. East Sandwich. And, and right across the street is a flat roofed one story house, like square. They're all very small lots, that whole neighborhood, you know? And um, about a year ago, I think it was in. June or July last year, they came in with a three-story plan. The first story is garage. Oh, wow. We're talking about the small house or the brewery? Take, no, take, take the small house out. You know, Who's proposing the brewery to stays, But, um, you know, they're in business. It's doing all right. But right across the street, this little house, and because of the floodplain and all that baloney, you have to put nothing underneath, kind of. So they put a three-car garage. And then the second story, third story, widows walk, decks, and so on. And I never saw those plans until recently. And um, then came this year, around February, March, it's been February, uh, they came in with a revision to the old plan, which was quite a bit different, even more ugly, <laughs> and with a spiral staircase on the outside going up to this top level. And uh, you know, it's a great spot because you can see the entrance to the canal and all the shipping going in and out. And you can see everyone on the beach and everyone's staggering out of the brew house. <laughs> <laughs> so let me, uh, so the brew house, is this a private residence? Yeah. Oh, okay. So yeah. it's not the brewery. Okay. But, wow. but the brew house is sort of a classical old Cape Cod house. Yeah. And all along the beach, you know, these McMansions yeah. are all nice looking houses. And up in the back on a little hill, a normal two-story colonial sort of houses. And this one is just oh, terrible. So it was denied and they're appealing it? So, yeah. Hmm. Well, the denial though, it's, it's the tricky part. I may have mentioned this before. Um, they had four, four members of the committee there and two voted for and two against. So that's an automatic denial. Mm -hmm. The chairman felt obliged to pass it and called another meeting 
and the same committee members showed up. But one of the committee members was an alternate. And the chairman has the option of using the alternate or not. You're, you would have to use the alternate if you only had two people there and you want three for a quorum. So she- But in the case of this tie- She rejected the alternate. To break the tie. To break the tie. Oh, wow. And the other guy walked out. And that's to pa pass it, to yeah. break the tie and pass it. Yeah. He walked out because he's a lawyer <laughs> and he wouldn't put up with this crap. Right. So they couldn't have a meeting with only two. <laughs> Mm -hmm. So it got appealed by two people. One lives in the neighborhood and one is very active in historic work in town. And um, sounds very political. And, and their claim is that it was rejected. It was properly rejected. It was on the record. The 45 days or anything like that didn't interfere. And so it should be rejected and they've got to come back with a new plan. So our job should be pretty easy, I think, <laughs> at this meeting. <laughs> that will say, yep. But it sounds fiery. Uh -huh. A lot of personality sounds like right. going on. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's kind of spooky. <laughs> and, and I'm interested to, to attend when we do, when, when the commission looks again at the exemptions for solar. We may do that. Yeah. We haven't put that really on the agenda right. for next week, but um, I suspect we will. Yeah. So I'll let you know okay. because if, if it will be, I think, it, I think it will. Because yeah. um, we'd like to get that moving. Yeah. 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 So. There was a um, <clears throat> some legislation that was um, part of a bill uh, that did not get passed. So there was legislation speaking to solar exemptions that it came out of Sears office and it was part of a bill, an amendment that was, uh, didn't pass just recently, like last week. So. Yeah. The, the, the scary thing is that, you know, down South, like South Carolina, North Carolina, there are a lot of developers that they build up lots of houses and they have a management kind of thing. Mm -hmm. And uh, and that's in court. Um, mm -hmm. And the theme is that we really own the house and we should have a right to using the sun that hits it mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. however we want. Mm -hmm. And uh, and that yeah, would- That's a pretty tough one to argue. That would give them an exemption. Yeah, it's like air rights. You know? Right. right. Okay. Wow. So we're, we're, we kind of watch that yeah. as well. So when is this uh, meeting? Well, the, the one on the sandwich is uh, for next Tuesday, a week, May 3rd. And the <coughs> other one is um, May 25th dealing with solar panels in Brewster. Okay. <coughs> I think they'll probably approve, <coughs> approve that one. Mm. Um, we'll see. Yeah. So my only question about the exemption for solar panels is then you don't have any abutters, don't right. have the opportunity to- That's my concern. It. You know, I'm gonna bring that up with the commissioners. You assume everybody is okay with solar panels. Some may, some may not. Yeah. That'd be the only thing that would you it's know. different in Dennis because Dennis made a whole region mm -hmm. exempt. Mm -hmm. And you but you had to still have um, black only solar panels. And what are the I, colors should they come in? And blue. I think in a neat blue? A very dark blue, oh. but it's still not black. Huh. Right. That was the early days of solar panels. That's where the, see the they use a backing, which is colored, and you can use a black background or a white. <laughs> and the, the panels are made up. I was in the, the business of 
doing this when I was working for IBM, making wafers oh, and making perfect. semiconductor uh -huh. chips and um, all the materials and lithography all associated with that. I had my hands in all, all kinds of stuff. And um, so the wafer is about this big and they cut the corners off and they put them on this big array and then connect them all together. And the backing where they put them down on, if it's white, then the color of the silicon shows up against the white and the white little lines in between show. But if you make it black, then it makes the silicon wafers look more blackish and the background is black. So, and then they put black borders. And has, has black become the norm at this point? No. Well, no. pretty much. No. They use it a lot. Yeah. Um, but they usually yeah. give you alternatives. That, like if you want to buy like 425 watt solar panels, you can get them out in a color. But okay, so that's what's new up on that level. Um, any other comments, questions? We can nope. and we can adjourn if someone will move to adjourn. Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 So I do have a procedural question since I am an alternate. Am I allowed to make motions and second motions or not? Oh, good question. Yeah. At any time or only when there's a shortage of a, a regular member? Well, Bob's not here tonight, right. for example. So I'm just curious, like typically if so we had six people here. were four to five working. Right, but if Bob were here and there were six people and I was the alternate, am I supposed to zip it? <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't think so. Okay, I was just curious how that- Technically maybe yes, but- okay. Uh, I've been, in running I've been, the meeting, I like to have everybody well, I've been involved. Trying not to. And contributing. Well, I ask questions, but I try to make motions because I wasn't sure if I was really supposed to. No, it would be all right. Okay, I just was the, curious. Uh, yeah, because we want to get your point of view too. Okay. You know, and you may see something that we don't. Great, like thank you. Like how to build a better flagpole. <laughs> <laughs> Someone walked by <laughs> my house yesterday and said, so when's a flagpole? When's a new <laughs> antique flagpole going up? And I'm going, oh, And are you from hearing it on TV? She Watching listens to the historic? meetings every, oh, every other week. <laughs> <laughs> I think we just are not on adjourned. anymore, but are we adjourned? We're adjourned. We're adjourned. I thought it was interesting. Um, Fred talked to his builder, and I think that you said, Richard, that you spoke with the head of the building department, right? Right. So there's, I don't know if there's conservation issues or not. You brought that, that up. Yeah, I don't know if we need to talk to them or not. If I was you, the core issue. We're also going to find out what you could do that. It would be a great idea. <laughs>